Okay, this is what I've been able to accomplish so far. Now, as you know, this is definitely the, the low side. And it's a lot more higher in that corner than it is down here, but it's definitely about 11 inches a difference in grade, okay? So I had to at least get this started. Now, remember, everything was about cost. I had all the CMU block. And I've got a little bit more, but not much. So that was free. Then I couldn't get to uh, the normal place, uh, Marietta uh, uh, Aggregate. They were closed today for Saturday. So I had to go to Mebane, uh and get and use their rock, which was $9 a ton more. So I only got, this is eight, this is ABC. This is real compactable material. This is what they build roads out of. If you're gonna build a road, this has a lot more finer aggregate in it. And when it gets wet, it basically compacts, just like concrete. You know, it just turns really hard. You know, you roll over it a couple of times, and this is what they use also for uh, concrete slab base. So that's called ABC, This, of course, this darker stuff. That's all the aggregate. It's basically a bunch of uh, granite sand. Okay, not too bad. Not too bad. I could go in there and fine tune it, but it's not too bad. You can see a little bit of wave, but that's no big deal. All right. So two and a half days so far dealing with this. literally been working out here eight hours a day just trying to trying to get my head wrapped around it i've already talked to riley foster welding he also has his own youtube channel he's over in mebbin and he's got a lot of material that i need uh when it comes down to uh stuff like building and prefabbing metal tubing okay he can do that and he's got the stock stuff that he's got left over and he's got a lot of it in other words we could frame out this entire thing in tube steel and and he's so talented he can build all the trusses and the pitch that i need and literally build everything on site and he's right around the street for me right down the corner but you can see the build up on this it's definitely Definitely 11, 11 inches, damn near foot, okay, of buildup. Now, I'm going to, of course, have to backfill in a whole bunch of rock in here, uh, uh, ABC, and, and, and be able to keep that retaining wall in place, okay? But, of course, it's going to get rebarred, and then it'll have be filled with concrete, and then it's going to be backfilled all the way down. So I'll create just a big berm right here and that abc won't move the stuff will pack in and it'll stay there and then by the time that i get enough rock in here which now 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 that i've got this started get that side put in the back the back's going to be super easy it'll that'll that'll be a breeze okay but this side over here is going to be another challenge but once i get and oh yeah, Riley also said that he's uh, he's got his uh, his uh, uh, contractor uh, uh, that leveling a device that he's going to bring out that digital leveler, and uh, and we're going to put this thing on grade so we know exactly where everything's at and how everything's going to work. Cool. <sighs> I'm tired. Now, from fixing the road out there, and also my neighbors, to starting in on this, I started everything, what, today, Saturday? 
I started everything on Wednesday. Yeah, Wednesday. I just got busy. You know, like I said, I'm a little slow on work, which is normal for this time of year. And again, it was supposed to rain all day. So that's two days in a row that if I would have had to listen to them and just stayed home, nothing would have gotten done. So I never, ever listen to the weather people, ever. I just go outside, and if it, something happens, something happens. That's why I play the game, man. All right. I feel like an excavation company now. <laughs> oh, boy. Either that or an installation company, a slab, concrete, foundation, you know, you name it. I'm teaching myself this. I'm trying to, I'm trying to do it right. I'm trying to get it really, really close to right. Uh, and, and, you know, if, if I screw up a little bit, uh, there's the learning curve, but I, I get this. I know, I know what it takes to put, uh, a level grade, you know, slabbing or, you know, a, a, a rock base and with retaining walls so we can get the framing, uh, started on the building. You know, there's all kinds of possibilities. Like I said, materials is the big thing. That's the big thing, the materials. Okay, like I said, I'm tired. I did get lunch. There's a, I went to go get this rock. There's a gas station that sells fried chicken. Oh yeah, country fried chicken. So that's what I ate. Talk to you guys tonight, love you.